All right, what's up guys? My name is John. Um, today I'm gonna do a quick video about what I do to keep my Sony a6300 from overheating. Um, this isn't like a foolproof method, and uh, obviously the camera will overheat after a while shooting 4K still, but it will uh, greatly extend the amount of time that you can shoot with this camera in 4K or 120p slow-mo uh, without the camera overheating. The Sony a6300 and a6500 are both incredible cameras uh, with beautiful, beautiful video quality, but they are kind of notorious for overheating. So today I'm going to show you what I do uh, to record long interviews and things of that nature and uh, prevent the overheating problem. Basically the biggest thing here is creating more airflow in the camera. So what you want to do is open as much as possible so as much heat will get out as possible. What I like to do first, this is the biggest area, is pull away the screen. Pulling away the screen creates a pretty significant amount of airflow and a pretty big area for heat to be released. Next what I like to do is hit the pop-up flash. Again, like I said, the name of the game is adding more airflow to this camera. After that, we're going to be opening up this trap door right here where you can do uh, microphone inputs and mini USB inputs. And again, after that, like I said, increase airflow and open the trap door for the battery. Uh, the battery actually heats up a lot and uh, opening up the door for the battery is a really, really big help. So as you can see right now, the screen's on. Um, that's sucking more power from the battery and um, using more energy basically to power this camera which creates heat. So what you're going to want to do to prolong recording time is turn off this main screen. The digital viewfinder takes a lot less energy to power and produces a lot less heat. So yeah, that's basically it. So like I said, the name of the game is increasing airflow and reducing energy consumption. This has taken my 4K recording times from about 20 minutes to about 25 to even 30 minutes of recording. The A6300 is an incredible camera, uh, but with the overheating, it can get a little bit frustrating, but this can be a huge help. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, I'd be stoked if you'd leave a like or subscribe to the channel or let me know in the comments if you want to see more like this. But yeah, thanks for stopping by. Uh, hope to see you around soon. Later.